Hello, everyone. Today I'm going to be smoking a blend called Westminster. And I'm going to be smoking it in my El Sapo poker. So here we go. Here's the last bit of this tobacco. So I thought I would uh, ease it up. This is by Sutler Private Stock. Again, it's called Westminster. And it's Latakia, Virginia's Orientals and Turkey. That's what the label says. And here's the pipe. My El Sepo poker. There's the insignia. Really nice. Really nice. Uh, this is my favorite poker. As far as looks. And uh, all the features that uh, you look for in a solid pipe. Okay, here we go. Smells very good. Terrific. And taste. Again, it has that. Uh, it's English blends with a lot of key and so I had this nice uh, burning leaves. Uh, taste and smell great simply terrific so I hope you're all doing on this Monday start of the business week and uh, hope you had a great weekend and uh, hope you have a productive uh, week and uh, if you're retired yeah, have a fun filled uh, week ahead of you all too Check out uh, Kevin's video, Louisiana Pipe Guy, 1965. If you don't know him, that's his screen name. Louisiana Pipe Guy, 1965, all one word. Uh, put up a video by my request uh, on a pipe that I had seen uh on a video he he put up a vid with that pipe and for some reason took it down so uh i called him and told him we'd like to see it again and uh he obliged me so he put the vid up yesterday and uh, uh it's there for your viewing pleasure if you don't know him he's a great fella uh Runs a restaurant down there in a uh, town, sort of like uh, north central uh, Louisiana. And uh, uh, he's a workaholic because he has a food truck also, in addition to the barbecue restaurant. So uh, check him out and uh, enjoy. 
Okay. I don't eh. didn't actually need to relight but gave it a hot shot as I like to say. Thank you to my new subscribers and uh Hope to provide you with some informative and entertaining bits. Again, uh, over and over again, we're hearing about this Ebola virus, and it takes so much of the news up, and uh, I, I don't know why it's captured the attention of the media, but certainly you must be getting bored with its coverage. I mean, with all the world's news, you click it on, and every night, the first story is Ebola. Give me a break. Give me a break. I would guarantee if they did a, if they did a survey, uh, you get a lot of people switching channels uh, uh, when they see this come up. We're just getting sick of it. It's crazy. It's really crazy. Imagine if, uh, imagine if, uh, aliens life on Earth, you know, like you hear these, these theories about, uh, there's, uh, uh, what's, what's is the, uh, the one, not Area 51, but there's a place where they think they're kept. Uh, and uh, was made public. Do you imagine the panic? And I'm glad that uh, whatever it is with these so-called aliens, that they're keeping it under wraps. Cause, uh, but a few cases of a virus that's been contained fairly well uh, we imagine if something earth-shaking like aliens have uh, landed and are here. Uh, so, with all this outcry about it should be public, I'm one that said that says publicly, uh, no, just keep it under wraps. <laughs> I wouldn't mind knowing, but. I don't think the public at large is ready for something like that. Well, anyway, that's a get off your ball. But, uh, uh, another Sunday night football that was a blowout. All these, uh, like I mentioned before, all these, uh, uh, you know, sort of showcase uh, contest uh, this year seemed to be uh, complete lopsided uh, affairs. And uh, I'm sure, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing that tonight is going to be uh, uh, lopsided also. Just my prediction. I don't have one or the other team. If you went by record, it would be Dallas, I guess. Uh, uh, they're six and one. They're pretty hot this year, so they probably all win. But you never can tell.
If you're wondering about the hat, uh, that uh, fella, Pipe Padre, I believe it is, uh, holy smoke, something around it, but has the exact same one. Uh, uh, well, correction, I have two of these. One is, is, uh, is uh, stark white and newer and he has the same that same uh, identical hat it's very popular but uh, it's this style I have two of these Can't say enough about this tobacco. If your shop has uh, this, pick it up. Again, it's Westminster by Sutler Private Stock. And uh, it's very, uh, I mean, they're out there. All the Sutler bl uh, blends are readily available. They're none that are really hard to get. So I would definitely recommend it. It's a great smoke. It's uh, not a heavy uh, lot of Kia. <laughs> Mild to mo moderate. Really nice, really nice. Uh, that message is for my daughter, and uh, I well, she lives with uh, her husband now uh, about uh, eight ten miles away but uh, put down that number as uh, uh, I guess they had it on file and being here she had to... but the big story that I've been meaning to say but I keep slipping my mind is my daughter is now pregnant and it's gonna have her first child She's about eight weeks now, and uh, uh, this is, of course, new, like I indicated, <clears throat> and uh, so <clears throat> <clears throat> we are delighted that she's going to be having a child, and I'll be a grandfather for the very first time, and... Uh, well, well, we'll be grandparents for the first time. And uh, looking forward to it uh, very much. <laughs> Wonderful. Now I'm on my last minute here, so going to wrap it up. Going to wrap it up. So you know what that means. Be good, take care of yourself, and by all means, happy smoking!